Hi, it's Doug Lunner with another Patch of the Week. Last week I showed you how to use a master clock and subdivide it with two serge envelope generators to create polyrhythms. That's basically what we were doing right there. We can hear the master clock and we hear the two envelope generators. But this week I want to take this very same patch and just put it up in the audio range and show you what else we can do. Alright, so now we've got the master clock at a very high pitch. I'm going to remove it now. And we can hear the two envelope generators. They're each uh, using a different division. As I change the fall of this envelope generator, you can hear the pitch change. It's going through a reverse harmonic series. So this one's doing the same thing, I'm just going to leave it where it is for the moment. But what I am going to do is I'm going to apply an LFO to its duration input, and that's going to give us harmonic arpeggios. If I take and apply the same LFO to the other one, I'm going to get another arpeggio, though they're going to be a little bit different. because it's there's a lot of complications and exactly when they change from one pitch to the, ne to the next. Okay, so now we've got two envelope generators doing har harmonic arpeggios, reverse harmonics. However, we can do more pitch change with this by affecting the pitch of the master clock as well. Alright, there you go. Another patch of the week. This time frequency division with surge envelope generators and harmonic, harmonic arpeggiation.